Hey guys, what's up and welcome back. It is a really exciting time to be a COD Mobile player. Like out of nowhere, the content lineup for like the rest of this year is looking pretty damn good. So in this video, we are gonna go over some new leaks and info which dropped a few hours ago of some very exciting stuff, including a new collaboration for all versions, a new BR map and more. So guys, watch the full video and here we go. Okay, so I want to start off by saying this info is coming to us from a verified Chinese content creator who is partnered with uh, COD Mobile. So this info is probably mostly accurate, but there's a chance that some things kind of might be false or slightly different to what actually ends up coming to the game. So keep that in mind. So I guess let's start with the biggest info and that is a new BR map is coming to the game. I spoke about this the other day, so I'm really glad my prediction was correct. Now not much is known at the moment regarding this map but it's speculated that it might be Solyudansk, I think I pronounced that wrong, a Kodem original map that was in development two years ago but was abandoned either due to technical issues or due to Warzone Mobile becoming a thing. The map is a combination of Verdansk and Blackout with POIs from both maps. So it's a combination of Verdansk and Blackout. It is speculated that it might be the this map due to strong hints from the comics and the clan war map, where the art lines up closely to the POIs from the Solyudansk map. The map is even mentioned and like I said shown in the comics multiple times, so it's very likely that this could be the map. I do want to say it is not confirmed to be uh, the Solyudansk map but it's a high possibility that it most likely will be. As to when the new BR map will release, my guess would be the 5th anniversary, as all previous BR maps were introduced in an anniversary season, e.g. Alcatraz in anniversary 1 and Blackout in anniversary 2, so it's likely that the next BR map will be coming to the game in anniversary 5, the 5th anniversary. So yeah, overall really exciting stuff, I don't know what changed over at COD Mobile's dev team, but the content lineup for the next couple of seasons looks to be really strong. Like we went through this dry patch I guess you could say, but things seem to be really picking up which is great news. So yes, a new BR map is most likely coming to the game this year absolutely great news so definitely give me your thoughts down below on this information are you excited or what let me know personally super super excited anyways though moving on to our next topic of the video a new collaboration is coming to the game and usually this is when i say it's exclusive to china and Garena. Well, uh, not this time. The collaboration is going to be with Gundam, and while I might not know much about this series, it's essentially based around giant robots known as mechs or mechas. Now, MW3 and Wars of Mobile had a collaboration with Gundam recently, where different mech mobile suits were introduced into the game through bundles. In COD Mobile, it's probably going to be through Lucky Draws, or actually, it's definitely going to be through Lucky Draws. So these skins from Modern Warfare should give us a good idea of what we could expect for COD Mobile's collaboration with Gundam. Okay, so that's about all we know regarding this upcoming collab for now, and I'm just happy that collaborations are finally coming to global again. Collabs are always an exciting and interesting thing, so it's just great news to see them coming to global once again. Hopefully this means more collaborations down the line uh, throughout the remainder of the year and going forward. Now next up we have some new news regarding the LST Legendary Ranked uh, Crate. It will most likely be containing an assault rifle, but there's a chance the translation could be incorrect which would then mean it might be a marksman or a sniper rifle. Once I get more info, I'll let you guys know. Now on the topic of free legendaries, another free legendary skin will be coming to the sea in version and at the moment we have no info if it will also be coming to global and garena fingers crossed hopefully it does and again once again more info i'll let you guys know now for our final topic of the day a new mp mode will be coming to the game later this year but again we have no info to what it might be again once i have more info i'll let you guys know 
And yeah, that's it. Some very exciting news. Like I said earlier, something seems to have changed over at Codem's development studios because the content lineup seems to be pretty stacked for the rest of this year and going forward. I mean, last year, we all thought Codem was going to be abandoned due to Warzone Mobile, but now it's looking like they still have massive plans for the game, which I mean, I am super happy about. So guys, definitely give me your thoughts down below in the comment section and with that being said, that is going to be all for today's video. So, thank you for watching, have a great day, and I'll catch you in the next one.